You are the criminal. Not in the Kano, myself, fire back at us. Well, hello, viewers. Welcome to my channel. Now, it don't happen again. According to the news of today, the movement for the authorization of the sovereign state of Biafra Maso has described former military leader Asad Kubo as a criminal and an economic saboteur. Maso was reacting to Dokubo's call that President Bola Dinebu should not listen to Khan, leader of indigenous people of Biafra Airport. After meeting with Dinebu, Dokubo said releasing Khan will be a reward for criminality in the Southeast. Reason Namde Khan is rewarding criminality and rewarding gross sum murder of innocent people. He should face the law for the action and instigations he has carried out, Dr. Wall said. Condemning the comment, Master Leader Uche Namado said the call was the ranting of a frustrated criminal. According to Madu, Asari Dr. Wall should be ashamed of himself for biting the finger that fed him by selling his conscience as an object of cheap sabotage against the collective interest of the eastern region in order to get relevance from the federal government he fought against and killed a hundred of military and other security agents as a dokubo is the criminal not in the can how can a man with illegal possession of general purpose machine guns and hundreds of ak-47 call a man without a, a catapult a criminal Maso wishes to remind as a himself and his militant criminal boys destroy and vandalize petroleum pipeline in the name of self-termination agitation for a job people. As I talk about asking Tribu not to release Nam the Kano is a direct exposure of the real criminal who should be ignored. Mas Nam the Khan is not a criminal or an inconsequential saboteur like the Muslim perpetual slave called as I talk about Asa. Now that I come to the end of the news, like I've always said, this man is the kind of man people should disregard. Though the time has come for people to call him to order because he's going to put himself into trouble soon. With the kind of utterances coming out from his mouth. Everybody, even a child of his they knows Nam the Khan is not a criminal. Nandika did not carry any arm against the government. But he do not want us to allow our land to be taken away by Janja weed that Buhari created. People like Kaisari should hide their face in shape. Though Chenna Mada answered him very well. And I'm saying this today. If our side does not take time, <laughs> Believe me, it's not a threat. He's going to see what he's looking for. People claim they are tough, they are hardened, they are this and that. But believe me, getting people out of the way is just a very simple thing. Even with the whole people surrounding them, it's only children. Who they are born yesterday. When it comes to deadly, we continue to watch Asare insult evils. But like I said, which and mother answered him very well. It's inconsequential. This is a militant who killed so many soldiers in the name of fighting for self termination. But I'm the Kano who has not killed anybody. His bravery is his mouth, his action, those following him, not carrying a K47 going around killing people. As Sare should have respect, does not. Has not. People should disregard us. He is nothing but a man who made himself reach through oil bunker. I don't want to mention the people he is doing the bunker 
with if not they will go after them I know so many of them he knows even his friend is right there and worry who has petrol station everything for station I don't want to mention his name I said he should respect himself he claimed the soldiers have been the one doing the bunker. But Asar has narrated himself because he wanted to buy favor from the hands of a man who was a drug peddler who gave a damn if he would become president or not. As far as I'm concerned, he's not my president. A man who did not win election freely and fair. Why should I call such person my president? A man who was selected by a neck. Why should I call such a person my president? I've said it several times. It doesn't matter. As far as he's concerned, he's not a president of Nigeria. But like I said, he's not my president. But he should do the right thing. By losing those who has not committed any crime. By losing those who the court of law has discharged. Unless he want to do the level of his so-called predecessor. Muhammad Buhari. If that is the leg he wants to do, people are still there to make his government ungovernable. The only thing he will do is to keep people as usual. Just like Buhari. And he will end up being a failure. We should tell ourselves the truth. Any government who claim he wants to fight corruption in Nigeria have to start from the security of the land have to start to fight insecurity as you plan to fight insecurity you have to first of all release those that you know that the court has set free otherwise you will be Doing the same thing that your predecessor did that made him fair. Like I said, Uche Namadu said the fact Asare is nobody. He should be disregarded. She's nobody. He can compare Asare, a common criminal, with him, Maznam the Kano, who is a freedom fighter. Asare has made it clear. I'm not the one that called him criminal. He's called himself criminal. When he made it clear that he has to fight for his stomach first before fighting for the stomach of others. Meaning that he is a hypocrite. A betrayer, a saboteur. Who sabotaged Biafra's struggle. For no reason. Because of money and gain. When Uche Mwe 4 could lie with aspect of boys, when I find that Uche Mwe 4 was nothing but a chicken shit, no matter what happened, you don't need to collide with the enemy. You don't need to collaborate with the enemy. To blend evil against your own brother. I don't think I have more to say in this. Which is Namad have said it all. Nam the Khan is not a criminal. Rather, as I thought, what is? I think I've come to the end of this news. Jay, your friend.